How many times do you have a patient who tells you they have a penicillin allergy and you wonder, do they actually have a penicillin allergy? I'd often ask the students, so how many of you believe or your mother told you that you're allergic to penicillin? Dr. Black is professor of pharmacy at the University of Washington. Out of a class of 100, maybe five or 10 every time would like raise their hand. And when you would ask them, they didn't really know for sure. Maybe they had a rash 30 years ago when they were given a drug for an ear infection. Problem is, a patient with a self-reported penicillin allergy will require a less effective and more expensive drug. We now know with a lot of data that persons who are incorrectly labeled as penicillin allergic, that leads to worse outcomes. The new calculator is right inside Sanford Guide Antimicrobial and lets you quickly determine whether or not a patient's self-reported allergy needs to be formally worked up or if they can be treated in a routine way. If a person's score with a PenFast tool is less than three, so that means either zero, one, or two, the negative predictive value of that is around 96.3%. The data suggest that you can go ahead and challenge that patient with a dose of the drug you want to use, monitor that patient, and if they do well with that first dose, you can potentially delabel them and remove that penicillin allergy from their medical records. It's a simple calculation, but it's difficult to remember what the questions and point values are. And like all Safer Guide content, the calculator has clear references to the sources.